Hey there, I'm Magica, and in our last video we created our Route 1 Rodent, the Capybara Pokemon line, and our Pika Clone, the Cute Harvest Mice Pokemon. And all of our videos so far have been about creating new fake ones, so I struggled a bit with the idea of bringing something different to the channel. But I figured that this channel is about various creative processes, so it wouldn't be fair to leave one of my favorites out and that is actual character design. And yes, recently, the creation of new Pokemon has shifted towards character design rather than just monster design. This is because they need to have a strong personality in order to be highly marketable. With the transition to the 3D games, more emphasis has been placed on giving each new Pokemon a unique personality. And honestly, I love that, but we can't forget the actual characters that appear in these games, such as the Nurse Joys, playable characters, gym leaders, and all the many, many different categories of Pokemon trainers you'll be battling throughout the game. So for this video, I decided to create the first character we actually see when we boot up any Pokemon game, our trusted Pokemon professor. As I wanted to show more of the actual creative process with this one, I decided to show the sketching, which is usually the part it takes the longest with these kinds of projects. Usually you have to make 5 to 6 different complete designs with a basic thought of colors and shapes that you want for the character. This is not the case for this one, I decided to have this video mostly as a first draft not only for the character, but also to see if you guys would enjoy this kind of content. So, before recording, I had a rough idea of what I wanted the character to look like and had a full page full of references to guide me. Using references is always helpful when trying to replicate a specific style. Although, of course, I chose to go with my own style rather than the official Pokemon style for this project, having guidelines as you're drawing or creating a character is always really helpful. Now, moving on to the design of the character. As I said, I already had a big idea for what I wanted for her, and that was because I noticed that the Pokemon professors have a thing that they do or study. And while I was looking for references, I noticed that was indeed the case. Bulbapedia even have a whole list of their areas of study. And I wanted her to be kinda like Professor Leventon and Professor Birch in personality and area of study. These two Pokemon professors research Pokemon ecology and habitat, respectively. And I wanted our very own Professor Pine to research these same things. So where Pokemon live, how they work, and what are their behaviors. My first idea was for her to look a lot like a park ranger or a zoo worker, but I felt like that wouldn't have much personality. And this is where the other half of the inspiration for these characters comes in. Brazil. I have decided that this region will be inspired, in fact, by the South American continent, with a slightly higher focus on Brazil, since that's where I'm from. But I've also realized that I couldn't make her the most interesting character. Since this was another thing that I noticed when looking for references, most of the Pokemon professors are just some guy. Of course, our last two Pokemon professors from Scarlet and Violet were an exception to this rule. In the end, I liked this design, but again, this is a first draft and I could come back to this design at a later date too. And even if now I've decided the main inspiration for our project, I still have to decide on the region's name. If you have any ideas, I would love to hear them. I just hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video.